What's up guys, it's Joe the Pro here back at it again with another video. Before this one starts today guys, I need you to please drop a like on this video, hit subscribe, and hit the post notification bell. Today what we are going to be reviewing is the purpose of the pin elevator wheel. So basically, what the pin wheel does, it is the wheel shaped mechanism that is in the back of the machine and it is responsible for picking, retrieving all the pins that fall into it, guided by the carpet, and placing them down on the distributor. Today we are going to be reviewing exactly how it functions. Well, this is a pinwheel that I have sitting out of the machine, and I'm just going to show you how the wheel picks up the pins. When the pins fall into the wheel, it's rotating depend it and the way it rotates depends on whether it's an even machine or an odd machine this wheel is from an even lane and the way you can tell is the way that the little slats here are positioned once the pins get swept off of the pin deck that when they get to the back of the machine they will fall into this wheel and this wheel is driven by a pulley on the back end motor and a V-belt. Once the pin falls into this clamp, there's seven of these clamps on the wheel. So once the pin falls into it, it makes its way about halfway up the wheel. And if you look, once it gets to the top of the wheel, if there's nothing there supporting it, it'll fall right out. So that is why when the pin gets about halfway up the wheel, it's more like here, but there's not a clamp there. So when the pin makes it about halfway up the wheel, there are these little levers in the wheel called toggles, and there's an actuating piece on each machine that will actually activate the toggle. And that is what keeps the pin secure in the wheel until it gets to the top. And there's another lever that if the uh, table still needs pins in it it will actually open the toggle once the pin gets to the top of the wheel and drop it on the distributor so some other things to watch out for is you got to make sure you're keeping up with these rollers make sure you're greasing them every couple weeks or depending on how often you're using your machines always inspect like i said that lever down there the toggle activating device here you always want to keep everything on the pinwheel all lubed up because you got to keep in mind this wheel is always rotating whenever the machine is on so there's obviously a lot of wear since it's metal on metal so now what we're going to look at is how the solenoid drops the pins back on the distributor after the table spots pins so once the cups come back up it activates that solenoid and they drop back on the distributor belt there and a new set of ten pins is fed. So you can see that last toggle opened and once the pin counter counts the last pin, then they all stay closed. That covers the overview of the pin elevator wheel on an AMF 8230 pin spotter. If you guys have any questions about anything I didn't cover, or if I missed something, please let me know in the comments and I would be happy to answer any questions. Please drop a like on this video, hit subscribe if you haven't already, and have a good day, and we will cover more material in the next video. Thanks for watching.